the root of psoas muscle problems is muscle movement memory. Muscle movement memory controls and shapes posture and movement. The intense sensations of injury, the cringe response, also called trauma reflex, and repetitive use patterns change muscle movement memory in unhealthy ways. For example, an injury to leg or foot causes us to lift up the leg or foot and to hobble in walking. Lifting the leg and hobbling involve the psoas muscles. Repetitive use, as in sitting for long periods, perched on the edge of a chair, tensely erect at a high level of concentration, causes a tension habit to form in the muscles of sitting, which include the psoas muscles. Both situations cause muscle movement memory to change. When muscle movement memory changes, we end up in a new habitual state of tension. That tension causes muscle fatigue and pain. Muscle movement memory can't be changed by stretching. Muscle movement memory is what we involuntarily return to after we stretch. Indirect therapies use stretching, manipulation, massage, breathing and passive relaxation, visualization and or skeletal adjustments. What they all have in common, none change muscle movement memory, but only seek to counteract the effects of muscle movement memory. How do we know? Look at the results of such indirect approaches. Results are telling. Now you may understand why. The more direct approach to eliminating psoas muscle pain changes muscle movement memory at the self-control level, the brain level. The approach explained, recommended, and offered here.